Good morning! It's I am Lou here, looking a bit dishevelled this morning. I'm going to kind of run through a typical morning that like I get up to, whether it's before, you know, I exercise, do physiotherapy. Excuse the bummed up nose, I'm feeling like crap this morning because possibly my body knows it's the start of the get fit challenge health kick thing. So, because I'm going to get myself a big glass of water. Um, with this, what I'm going to put in this is a thing called whole psyllium husks. Now I got mine from myprotein.co.uk. Now this stuff is brilliant. Now if you're doing a low carb diet, which I am doing, the thing about a low carb diet is that you eat a lot of protein and there's not much fibre because most things you eat, like um, whole bran, which I get from Sainsbury's in the UK, it's got a lot of carbs in it per bowl. I think this is the equivalent of like 12, 13 grams of carbs. Now, if you're doing induction, it's pretty bad, you know. But me, I'm not going to focus on Atkins as such and like strict, completely low carbs. I'm just kind of reducing my carbs to try and, um, you know, lose that bit of weight because I'm not going to be able to do as much exercise as somebody else due to the chronic pain. So, psyllium husks, correct me if I've said it wrong. They are brilliant, especially for me, because I take a lot of painkillers, um, such as cocoa, damal and things like that. With some people, sorry to be a bit grossy, they kind of can bung you up with it and not allow you to go to the toilet much. So with these, this is like cold natural fibre. And it says to have 1 to 2 grams into at least 350 grams of water. So, I'll just get my water, bear with me. Add it. I mean, I don't know if, I, if none of you have never seen it before. It's pretty. They're just like little edge, like casings of of seeds. I don't know whether you can see that. It's almost like a little powder. But when you actually look closer, it's like, you know when you buy potato mix, like mashed potato mix? It's almost like a, a really smaller version of that. But it's natural. So I'll get... Um, one teaspoon, put it in the water. Now it has got a warning on the back of the packet on this and it says um, be sure to drink plenty of additional fluids and consume immediately because it kind of has a thickening agent. It's really strange. It's I don't know. It's You can see it's almost going like a jelly. It's not but it, it, it does actually thicken the water. You can actually feel it thicken in the water. After drinking that, I will sometimes mix in with the psyllium husks or have it in you know a small glass. L-glutamine. Right, well what that is, I mean I got 500 grams of this from my protein.co.uk. Don't worry, I don't own the company. I'm not kind of advertising this like, ooh, ooh, yeah. Um, no. It's just that it was the cheapest. Everywhere I'd gone, I'd gone on eBay, I'd gone on, um, I'd gone everywhere, you know, searching on the internet. And for 500 gram, it was like 20 odd pounds. I got a tenner, 10 pound. Brilliant. So sometimes I'll have a little bit of that in it. What that does is it helps your immune system, helps you stop getting sick as much. It helps you with your workouts and things like that. Um, and also, which I will you know turn you around in a minute I have one cup of coffee I normally have like a nice hot espresso in the morning um, to kick start me because I like to do any kind of physical activity on an empty stomach only because I feel that it um, helps you burn more I don't know I mean things I've read on the internet is that when you exercise on an empty stomach your internal levels are used to kind of fuel your you know your general day-to-day -day workings like your brain and whatnot and that you know you will use your muscle stores when or whatever you've got there to do your workout and then after I've done you know whatever physical activity for that morning whey protein sorry about the sniffles uh, body fortress whey protein I mean this is strawberry flavor it's actually not that bad I thought it was going to be horrific and it's really not this cost me £12.50 I think it was from Holland and Barrett, but get it when the sale's on. That's the best time to get it because um, it's cheaper. Do the math! Right, okay, so my espresso machine 
is waiting for me patiently. I have my little Wedgwood espresso cups. I'm so sad. My AEG Bells and Whistles coffee machine. Right, turn the light off. I've just used my filter. I press the button. Oh, coffee. How fantastic is that? I am one happy person. I have espresso on tap. And I will um, do another video today. Today, this is the plan today, really quickly. I am going to go shopping to get my food. I'm going to Aldi. For people obviously in the US don't know what Aldi is. It's a European kind of supermarket, but they sell every bit of shit you can think of, but at a really cheap price. Like parma ham, cheeses, lunch meats, all that kind of stuff is actually really cheap there. So I'm going there to get my bits and bobs for snacking on. And then I'm going to Sainsbury's, which is my local supermarket, and I'm buying flaxseed because I'm going to try out flaxseed bread and flaxseed crackers. How exciting my day is to try that. Amazing. So um, I'll probably do another video of that and the disaster that I make in the kitchen. So thanks for watching and um, I'll keep you updated throughout the day. So have a good day everyone and keep losing weight. Yay!